First, as far as methods are concerned, where do the methods come from? One obvious source is the operations in our analysis model. In addition to the specific services provided, there are uh, signals, okay, and there may be actions, activities, and events in any uh, behavior model, such as state charts. We also have to make sure that we're assigning those operations in the form of methods to particular classes. In addition to those that come directly from the analysis model, there's others we should always be aware might need to be included in our classes. These in include constructors and destructors, getters and setters, copy constructors, printers or, or uh, methods that construct string versions of the data inside of a class, selectors, if you have uh, complex data, how you're going to take out the pieces of it, and um, any kind of uh, iterators if you have if your class has more than one, uh, uh, you know, is a collection class of some sort, how are you going to provide the elements of that collection? It's not necessarily the case that every class has to have all of these methods, but you should be aware of the possibility of their existence so you can uh, determine early on whether or not that you need to define them.